yeah, there we are. See? Oh, lovely. Um, to show uh, Grace or whoever is going to be doing this later on, um, that you've got an Explore tab. This is where you can uh, search for and collect art. And then you've got a uh, profile tab. This is uh, your 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 collection, uh, and you get the uh, chance to create content by clicking this tab here. Um, and then you'll see uh, this is where your mint passes a bit will be. So when you've um, created the piece of content, you'll get ten uh, mint passes, so you can collect other people's work. This is notifications to show who's following you, who's uh, collected your work. This is the log out tab, and this is the light and dark tab. Like I say, the search is pretty good as well, which we can look at in a bit. So I'm gonna uh, create. So we need to create a contract, that's first. This is where we got to last week, right? Contract is basically, uh, yeah, you don't have to do anything. You just click next and it'll just create it. It, it, it has the uh, default username and just says it's that username's collection. That's the contract number, the uh, details, and that's the fixed royalties. So once you've created that contract, every piece of content you put on uh, to that collection will have a 20% royalty associated with it. But if you create a custom one, you get to basically put your custom name in. So Okay, so this is where you can set the royalties. So by default, it was set as 20% um, on the on the other contract. So you could actually raise this to 25, 20, 30. Well, loads. You can raise this really high. So basically, so it is zero royalties on this. And then to answer your question, uh, is this what you're asking about? Enter token name. Yes. But whenever it's asking for a token name, it's like. Um, it's like a symbol of that of that contract. Yeah. So DMC will be the sort of short short name of that contract. So, so let's say you had okay. um, a collection called Potato Heads. Yeah. You'll do P H. Yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna I'm gonna click next. Sorry, can I just so do you create yep. a new type of contract? Just one is is and this is for the whole account. In yeah, this is just for the whole right? account. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's not like you can't do it per project, it's per no. account. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, so you'd have to open another account with another email in order to set up a new collection or something like that. Very, oh, very simple, royalty percentage my... is required. Um, <laughs> so you have to put a royalty amount. In the lounge there. Ah, just put 1%. So 1%, yeah. So you get all your pop-ups. Click OK. Again, you can't reverse this process once it's, once the contract's set up. It's set up, and you only have to do it once, obviously. OK, so we've set the contract up. Um, now we can uh, mint the NFT. I'm going to browse, desktop, image. Uh, what should we call it? Event case, DMC event case, yeah? Um, and then information for Meetup Weekly, is it? Yeah. Okay. And we're going to do 100, but it's quite good maybe for us to keep some. Okay. Um, just in case, you know, in the future we want to give, we want to gift it to people, new members of the collective or whatever. 25. Um, and then tags, are you using tags, everyone? Yep. I'll just do one tag. DMC maybe. Yep. All present and correct. So I'm going to mint it. There we go. Yay! Yay! Entered. There you go. We've created a digital maker collective <laughs> token, which I think is pretty cool. Um, and then obviously, yeah, you can go to your creation. I, what I would say about the minting process is be patient, uh, especially with large media, don't, just because it can take a long time to, to load in and load up. And if it fails, just 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 leave it for a few days and, and come back to it because it, it sometimes, like I say, it fails and then mints like two days later. 
Um, so the view transaction is basically that should be like a, a blockchain version of the of the of the information on the blockchain. Um, and then you go to your creation. Um, you can buy one. You want me to buy one? Collect, collect, collect. And then once you've once you've minted and you go to explore, you'll see that it's um, it's on the front page. That's what I really love about this site is that everything goes into this one this one stream of content. How Very much like kicking knock, kicking knock in the beginning, old, isn't it? Old old days, yeah, exactly. Yeah, old school. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay, so we've minted that now, and then basically what I was going to show you is uh, so once you've got a token and once you've collected token, oh, I've got ten passes now. So. Basically, the first thing I want to do is to see whether any of our Fish to Make a Collective have got any pieces I can collect. So has Christina got one I can get? Hey, there you go. Um, that mushroom one went. I'm going to collect this one. I like, I like this idea. We've got like our own little archive of uh, of collecting content. Cool. Excellent. Thank you. That was really good. Thank you, Chris. Oh. oh. oh so people have collected us.